Hi, I ordered takeout. So I'm gonna show you how to eat pho when you order takeout and how to put it together. So first thing I'm doing, I'm boiling some water because um, if you order rare beef, it's gonna be basically raw. So you need to boil the water so you can cook the beef. So that's what I'm doing right now is boiling the water. So I have my bowl here and I'm gonna put my pho together. First thing I'm gonna do is put in the vegetables and my seasoning. Oh, actually, the noodles are already cooked. So they do cook the noodles for you. So these are my vegetables that they give me. And then here's the noodles already cooked with the vegetables blanche and then the rare beef. So the rare beef I'm cooking in boiled water. So I'm gonna set that aside and do that last. So I'm gonna pull this to the side and do this last. So with my noodles, I'm gonna put it in my bowl. And then I'm gonna keep adding the vegetables and seasoning to the bowl. So let's do the vegetables. Here are basil leaves they give me, but I'm not gonna use the basil leaves. I'm gonna cut the jalapeno into a little bit smaller pieces. I'm gonna squeeze the lime juice in there. I'm gonna put the bean sprouts in there. So here are the bean sprouts, the raw bean sprouts. So I'll just put it to the side right here. Okay, I think that's enough, that's a lot. Okay, so I've added the bean sprouts. I'm gonna, I already cut the jalapeno into smaller pieces. So I'm gonna put that in there. Let's see, they didn't give me any cilantro. I don't use the basil leaves. I use that for my shrimp spring rolls that I also ordered. But, um, so I'm just gonna add my vegetables, my own vegetables that I already cut up. So I got a cilantro mix with celery and green onions and red onions and some bean sprouts in there. So I'm gonna add more vegetables. Now I'm gonna add my seasoning. So I'm gonna add, let's see, I'm gonna add the seasoning first that they gave me, so the sriracha hot sauce. Dump that in there. So if you like it spicy, you dump that in there. If you don't, then you don't have to add it in there. This is uh, oil pepper, some kind of like uh, oil, chili oil but I don't use chili oil in my soup, so I'm gonna pass on that. This is what hoisin sauce looks like in a bottle. The hoisin sauce in there. This is all optional, so you don't have to put everything in there if you don't want, but this is how I make mine. And then um, I like the dried pepper flakes, so I'm gonna add that. And I'm gonna Take some sugar in there, just a little bit, just a little bit of sugar. Fish sauce, because I like it a little bit saltier, just a little bit. And this is a sweet soy sauce, a dark sweet soy sauce. So I'll put a little bit of that in there. You don't have to use this if you don't have it. It's, it's fine, it'll still taste good. So I have my homemade um, rice, um, not rice, pepper vinegar. It's pepper garlic mixed with uh, vinegar. So I'm gonna put that in there. And then I have fried garlic. Scoop of that. I have one more thing. I like using this preserve. Oh, shoot. 
I like using this preserved cabbage in my soup. A little bit of that. And let's see. Oh yeah, I want some more sriracha. So let's go cook um, my meat. I'm a, this is the meat, I'm gonna just blanch it in the hot water. I'll be right back. So I blanched the rare beef in hot water. So it's still medium. So I'm just gonna put half of that in there. All right. Did I put everything in that I need? Okay, I think I did. So now I'm gonna open my package. Now they pack the broth separate from the noodles and the vegetables, because if you keep it together, the noodles will soak up all the broth, and then you won't have any broth left. So I'm gonna now add my broth. So it comes in a container. And it's, it's still warm, so I'm gonna pour my broth in here. And I'm just gonna use half, because I have uh, some extra meat that I'm probably gonna use for a second serving. Okay? And that's how you put together your takeout fa. It's very simple. You just use all the ingredients that you like and put it into your bow and mix it together. And this is what your take home, your takeout file looks like when you put it together, just like this, just like in the restaurant. You can do it yourself. Thank you, and I'll see you tomorrow.